could go either way, couldn't it? Easy or. What? This could go either way, couldn't it? Oh, you'll get trampled. Yeah. They've got a bit too tame. When we're going with a bag, they get quite, well, I don't say aggressive, but excited. They get excited with themselves. So, yeah, the plan is we're going to walk them up into a yard at Beckett Shed and then take them down to the other farm, which is over there, with cattle box. We ain't got that uh, 16 footer now, we've just got one behind car. Uh, pick up so so we'll see how it goes but three there's three what are a little bit suspect what are a bit holler the rest of them if you look them the welling calf so so we'll see how this goes right but the, the reason we'd had to left them out a bit longer but they've uh, there's been that much rain that they're making a mess now so it's time to rain right it's beyond them come on then Come on! Come on then! Come on! I think if we keep, I think if we keep walking, don't you think they'll just come? Come on! Who's that then? Come on! I think they'll come. Come on, Dad! Oh, can you carry my stick? Come on then! Come on! Come on! Usually he comes, doesn't he? They're usually after they're fed, they come to the gate anyway, so they may be as uh, as easy to handle as we once thought. We or as I, I thought. Come on then! They're lovely looking though, they're as hardy as hell, they aren't taking no fault. Come on, come on then, come on then, come on, come on Lacey, that one's Lacey, Ollie's favourite. There we are, look. Come on then. They're not going to stampede me, are they? Do I need eyes in the back of my head? Oh my god. I think he's all right. Come on then. I think we'll just keep going. Yeah, very keen. Had to defrost cars. Even doors were frozen up. I don't know what minus it was, but yeah, we aren't used to it. Come on then. Here they are, look. A grand bunch, aren't they? Yeah, there's one of here up front. It's a bit holler. I don't think that one's in calf. There's three to uh, test. Come on then. Oh, this one and all, is that number 15? Yeah, I think that one's to test and... Yeah, we got, there's no... I mean, at this stage, bloody hell, they've been through three or four cycles that... They'll, they're barren-like. We ought to be on horses, <laughs> like cowboys. Come on, then. Come on, Dad! Oh. Ah, it's bags heavy. Hey, you bugger. Come on, then. Come on, girls. Come on, girl. Do I just walk it? I'll just walk it. And you stand there, maybe. Come on, girls. Hey, up. Come on, Ed. Come on, Ed. Hey, 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 hey. Come on. Good girls. Come on, girls. Come on. Come on, girls. Come on, girls. Come on then! Got three escape peas. Oh, four. oh god, no. One, two, three, four, five, six escape peas. When they saw these cattle, they all went sort of, I don't know, more interested in them. Come on. 
So what we're going to do, we're going to shift them in there and then these might be keener to come in later on. Angelica's here from West Point Vets, PD in our car. Well, we're only going to do three, but she's sort of at cost of it, peace of mind. We're going to do all the lot. And we've only done one, but so far, so good. She's five, five to eight months uh, in calf, so. And that was one of the leaner ones, so yeah, bit of good news. I'm blood testing them as well because, uh, well, just peace of mind, really. Right, what, what, what we're looking for, Angelica, in your eyes? You know, what can you see? So, it depends on the stage of pregnancy. In the early stages, yeah. we're looking for an embryo inside the, the uterus, which is, it looks like, just like a tiny spot. A like tiny, a, like white spot. A bit of a spot. shadow. Oh, yeah. right, right, right. Tiny white spot inside uh, a bright black liquid. And as we go on with pregnancy, like around 60 days, you can see um, a small embryo which resembles um, like a small calf, a baby calf. Right. Just like this tiny, but you can't like uh, tell every uh, structure right. in, in his tiny body and later on what we can see are the uh, cotyledons which are which are the structures uh, formed by a structure on the mother's womb and on the placenta right. which take blood to the fetus from the mother and like when we are around the eight months we can see like a hoof or the head if we're lucky because the so you, you at the moment then we can't really see a developed calf out like that no the only thing that we are seeing now because all these car all these heifers are staged around um, between five and eight months of pregnancy what we can see are um, the cotyledons so right. Yeah. These structures that make us being completely sure that they are pregnant. Yeah, good stuff. This is one we've marked actually, we're a bit unsure of whether it's in calf, so hopefully. Fingers crossed. She's having another look, but it's turned out we can't find out in this one, so one we thought, thought was suspect is, uh, sounds like it's barren. Bad news really, but anyway. Actually stands quite nice there, look. Don't I? 
Got two condemned, one in corner. And here, I don't know why I feel led that to its burrhead, but yeah, there I think fat yard, I'm afraid. Is this a thumbs up? You're gonna see a baby, a baby wolf and a baby baby. What's your name, love? Uh, Nicola. Nikki. Nikki, you yeah. can also have a look. Try. Angelica. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry that I didn't take the oh, screen right. no with problem. me. Have a look. Do you want to have a look first? So where, where are the goggles and, and look? <laughs> I don't know if you, if you oh, can yeah. see the wolf. Because obviously she's moving, so I don't know if I am in the same spot. Yeah. Can you see the baby hoof? Yeah. Get on. Cool, aren't it? <laughs> it may have moved. Can you see? I think so. Oh, it's moving right now. And this was the one we were a bit suspect with. Because this is uh, not not more than four months pregnant. It's a bit, it's probably, a bit late. Yeah, she got pregnant later than the other ones. Oh yes, yeah, I can. Can you see? Yeah, I can, yeah. I'm moving it now with my finger. Yes, you can, yeah. Hey, that's really good. You're more excited than when your kids were <laughs> scanned. <laughs> they cost me money, they <laughs> Well, you have a point. <laughs> All right. Come, stop. Very good. So you say she's a bit later, Bob? Four, no more than He seems to have settled down on his own. I mean, we had to separate him. One, well, he wants to build a bit of confirmation up, a bit, a bit of, you know, strength up for spring. Um, we're going to give him, well, as much hay as he can eat, really, I think. Um, we're going to drop the bollock, really. The two what are in calf we should have had in here. And, uh, and fattened them up a bit, because they would just want a little bit more than silage, really, and push them on. Um so reflection on today really. One is on his own, he's in solitary confinement. I thought he'd have created actually. I thought he'd have uh, caused a bit more fuss than he has, but he's quite happy. So you know quite happy on his own. Having a bit of respite from his uh, from his ladies. 
Maybe we could do with some oneself.